What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Tuggle Knight72 back here. We, in the uh, last episode, we finished off at Thamasa. We recruited Strago, and we've got Realm. And right now, we are heading to the Esper's Gathering Place. Alrighty. Let's have a look around. There's supposed to be a lot of goodies around here. Heal Rod. This is actually good. You can actually attack uh, yourself to do bet to heal yourself. And notice how the attack power goes up, too. As I was interrupted by the random battle, the heal rod actually helps. Attack yourself, you heal yourself. We're gonna do a little exploring first before we head forward. Sorry that these random battles keep interrupting us. Whoa, what's that? That was Realm. We'll follow you in a second, sweetheart. As we're plagued by these random battles, What's going on here? Okay, oh, can't go up there. Oh, would you look at that? We found you. Apparently, Strago learned something. Hang on. What did he? What did he learn? It. Oh, remedy. Okay, that's good. But yeah, we found Realm. She's uh, wandering around every place she shouldn't be at. What's this? I can't believe it. These these statues. These statues. Some faint letters are carved in the back of the stone figures. Sail then. What else can you tell me about these goddesses? They're quite literally... Cr they quite literally created magic as we know it. So they're goddesses of magic, then what? Well, you could say that. I can feel their power. These statues are the source of all magic. It is said that the espers made these images and put them in a very special place. These represent power beyond all comprehension. Our espers, our espers no doubt came to this island to bask in this magical power. Sail Timer, what happened to the stone goddesses? Legend has it that they're hidden somewhere beyond the reach of humans. I'd say they're beyond the sealed gate. What if the barrier that protects the place is generated by these stone goddesses? Phew, what a story. If the Espers were attracted by these statues, there must be must be around here somewhere. I think it's worth a look. And of course the Grand... Whoa! Well, gee! Well, shit. <laughs> these shiny statues are all mine. These will get Siegfried's attention. Ooh, they're glowing. They're beautiful. Ladies and gentlemen, Ultros has made an appearance yet again. Don't you ever learn, Squidball? Well, they always said I was a slow learner, but I eat fast. Well, we're not here to tease the octopus. The octopus is here to start some shit. More life. I've got more lives than I do arms. You know what? I find that very easy to believe. Revenge it is. We're going to morph, and we're going to just do some battle. Alright, Terra. Uh-oh. Tentacle! <laughs> oh, come on now. Alright, well, you know what? Octopus soup. It is. Nope. Fucking hell. That's one thing I hate about this controller, though. It, it lags just a little bit. He only has about 22,000 HP. But with the damage that we can do, this will go down quick. Oh, wonderful! Okay, that just happened. Oh, Ultros, you came prepared, didn't you? Alrighty. You want to fight? We'll give you a fight. Okay, he's moving closer. That's, uh... I'm actually not comfortable with that. You're kind of getting in my bubble there, buddy. Alrighty. Bolt 2. Gotta burn your ass up. Alrighty. Yeah, just keep fi casting fire and casting a bunch. Oh! Haste! Oh! You're gonna speed up, aren't you? Oh! Actually, that was not... That was not smart. That was not smart at all. <laughs> Hope I'm not making a nuisance of myself. So sorry. Oh, I love your sarcasm. 
Oh yeah, that just happened. Yeah, I gave him the heal rod. Dumb fucking me. We're just gonna take that back. Lodestone. Okay, yeah, that uh, yeah, that'll happen. That's supposed to drain about 75% of your health. Alrighty, just keep staying alive. Attack, heal, attack, heal, and attack, heal. Okay, he's moving closer. Seems like the closer that he gets, the harder he hits, too. Grandpa! I'm here! Realm! I told you to stay at home. Gonna miss a chance to practice my drawing. Say, sweetie, who are you? How dare you. I'm Ultros. Uh, little girl, I've seen enough anime to see where this goes. Realm and Ultros. What are you doing? Listen, Ulti. Why don't you pose for me? I'm not one of your kitty friends. Don't talk to me as if I were. I don't want a portrait. Forget it. I don't want to draw it anymore. It's okay. I'll just jump down from here. Yeah. Tara, get away from the octopus. Ladies, stay away from the octopus. How dare you bother that little girl. Like I said, I've seen enough anime where a tentacle monster and a bunch of girls... I've seen where this goes. Ask her to draw your portrait. She may actually make you look pleasant. <laughs> Don't be so heartless. He's actually thinking about it. Oh, alright. Uncle Ulti really wants you to do his portrait. <laughs> You're gonna love it. This is uh, Realm's uh, special ability, by the way. Sketch. And anyway, come here. Okay, take a back seat real quick. Strago, I'm gonna need you to attack. We're gonna sketch you. Oh. Ultros' form has changed. Beware of his tri elemental attack. Come on. Ooh! Oh! How can this be? I I'm nothing more than a stupid octopus! Well, a little girl drew his port a little girl drew his portrait and the octopus fleed. Must be really ugly. G Gramps. Hm. I suppose it wouldn't hurt to have you along. All right already, if you insist. Yeah, it's better. Well, Realm is now a part of our team. Now, first we need to give her... Hang on. We're going to unequip Saffron. And we are going to give him Bismarck. And for Realm, we're going to give her... Oh, hang on. We're going to give her Saffron. We need to have as many healers as we can, because you never know when you're going to need it. Okay. Give Lock a couple of tinctures. Alright. Have Realm get nice and equipped. Actually, she's gonna need the Chocobo brush. She needs that to sketch. Birth of Magic. Three goddesses were banished here. In time, they began quarreling, which led to an all out war. Those unlucky humans who got into the way were transformed into espers and used as living war machines. The Espers created these statues as a symbol of their vow to let the goddesses sleep in peace. The Espers have sworn to keep the goddesses' power from being abused. The goddesses finally realized that they were laughed at by those who had banished them here. In a rare moment of mutual clarity, they agreed to seal themselves away from the world. With their last ounce of energy, they gave the Espers back their own free will and then transformed themselves 
into stone. Their only request was the espers to keep them sealed away for all eternity. Ooh, it's a hell of a story. And further and further we go. You know what? We don't. I don't got enough sleeping bags, but you know what? We'll just pitch a tent real quick. The cute little purple tent. Alrighty. Let's save up real quick. We've got further to go. Took care of the octopus. Now that the octopus is gone, let's see. Where else do we have to do? Now, if you also remember, take this. She automatically comes with the memento ring. You're going to want to keep this on her. We're also going to give her some earrings, too, because she's going to be a magic user, too. Oh! What just happened here? Ooh. Okay. Trap doors. Hope this takes us to something good. I'm sure it will. Whoa. Slurm. 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 Somebody's down there. It appears to be an Esper. Are these Espers? Oh. Oh. Oh, Lord. I feel like we're going to the wrong neighborhood. Stepped in the wrong neighborhood, man. What about you? I didn't think they looked so... Gramps, take Realm and clear out of here. Yeah, you, you, you want to save the little one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we definitely stepped in the wrong hood, everybody. Yeah, we definitely stepped in the wrong hood. You're a halt! Looks like Terra's father. Although not Terra's father. And that ominous music starts to play. I sense some immense magical power in Terra. It... It frightens me. I wonder if she's gonna go ballistic again. I highly doubt it. But whatever's gonna happen seems to be happening. You're somehow different. I sense a familiar power radiating from you. Yep. You're the espers that fled through the sealed gate. As a rule, we are not allowed to visit your world. We few gathered near the gate. We were wondering how we could save the espers that had been kidnapped. It was just coincidence that Terra appeared when she did. I felt your presence through the gate. We bolted the moment Terra opened the gate. But once in your world, we lost control of our powers. We completely leveled the city and took some innocent lives. That's what happened to me. I lost all control of my power. There must be something in your world that allows you to focus your power differently. You must use caution while in your world, in our world. We are deeply sorry that you've caused you humans such suffering and pain. Hey, the past is history. The Empire seems to want to talk peace with you. 
why not come with us? They would forgive us so e uh, I don't know about that. Forgiving us. Forgiving y'all easily. Let's go to Tomasa and talk with General Leo. Oh, even better. General Leo, he's, yep, he's a, he's a good man. General Leo? Log, you're back. And you've made the Espers understand our desire for peace. I am General Leo. May I have your names, please? I am called Yura. We have done something inexcusable to your people. This probably isn't the kind of place to ask for your forgiveness, but... Speak no further. It is we who owe you an apology. We hungered for your power. How close we came to reenacting the War of Magi? We must put all this behind us. Indeed you should. I believe our job is finally over. I, for one, could use some peace and quiet. Let's return to Vector. Please, not another word. Aww. There's some sparks between those. I'm too hot, Grandpa. <laughs> Kids. Wait. <laughs> you gotta break the tension a little bit. What's... Oh! Look who it is, everybody. How the hell did you get out of prison? And he comes with Magitek armor. Oh, this does not look good. <laughs> How about them little Magitek mayhem? Oh, no. Oh! Oh, shit. General is sipping up. Gafka, what are you doing? <laughs> Emperor's orders. I am to bring the Magicite remains to these espers to his excellency. Behold, a Magicite motherlode. Whoa. Apparently, Kefka has been a lot more resourceful to Emperor Distal than even we knew about. And see, I knew there was something going on. Idiots! I don't care for the appearance of this pit of a little hamlet, so burn it! Oh well. Yep. See, I knew there was something going wrong. See, Emperor Distal fucked everybody over. Kefka, no! Shut up! Hmm. Well, we've got General Leo. I wish I could see what his equipment and his relics were, but you can't, unfortunately. No skills to work with. So it looks like. Kafka, your behavior is dishonorable. I can't allow this. <laughs> gonna shock you. And he's gonna up and poison General Leo. Oh! Yeah, General Leo is quite a beast. It's too bad you can't use him for very long, though. Fire 3, huh? And he's able to strike four times. I believe he has the Offering equipped. And what appears to be a Paladin Shield. Whatever it is. Now, this fight, though, with uh, Kefka, is not meant to be necessarily won, but not necessarily meant to be lost. Just fight to your best. Ah, Leo. Always the, consum the consummate soldier. Where are you, Kefka? Show yourself! Emperor Gestal, I need you here. Leo, my liege. I'm so see. The power.
Don't say. Like you to take <laughs> so you I just saw such a stage such a good issues. You're such a silent little Hate! 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 Well... Kafka is on loose. What's going on here? Oh. Whoa! Yes! I feel some incredible magic power here today! Wave after wave of pure magic energy. Going on? Leave General Lee. Here's to be quick. Broken open. He's asked for to help out. We own their Whatever. Some mo focus. Take a body first, too. Such for six. Thinking you can I decide it's come as I had no idea. I have had to decide for that.
team. Definitely. Definitely a hero that should not. Now I'm worried about Edgar and the others. Hey, there was hmm. There's the rest. We've been had. The Emperor is no shit. Saw it from the beginning. Thanks to Edgar, escape before bad. the girls to <laughs> Watch your mouth. Rethink our airship now. Check, check, one, two, three. Check, check, one, two, three. Three, two, and one. May I accompany you? Yes. Who are you? He's one of the town's citizens. He's a senator from the Mage War Warriors of Yore. I think he can be a big help. You're going to need all the help you can get. We must expect the Empire to flex its newfound muscles soon. <laughs> yeah, right, kid. Definitely. Who's this puffed up aerobics instructor anyway? Kid's got quite a lip. I'm gonna paint your poor. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. Don't do that, don't do that. We saw what you did to Ultros. Alright, get ready, if you insist. That's better! Let's go. Hmm. What's wrong, lover boy? How old are you? Ten. Why? I'm coming along, too. You've grown up entirely too fast. Lighten up, okay? I don't even want to know what that means. The years after the... Oh, those silly aspers. To think they opened up the gate themselves. The statue should just be ahead. If we can just get our hands on them, we have everything we ever dreamed of. Come quickly. The island. The world is groaning in pain. Hmm. What's going on here? Something ain't right. Whoa! There appears to be... Okay, a piece of land floating. Just ominous. That's a bit...
This is power. This in my magicite. Now nothing can see. The big magic. Themselves away. The result Yep. Okay, I'm back. Now, sorry about that, I had some technical difficulties and I'm kinda just trying to work through this a little bit, but even with these technical difficulties that have come up, what I was so what I was trying to get done. What I was trying to say before I was so rudely interrupted by my computer's um, inadequacies was this is your biggest challenge thus far. The floating continent is not going to be any easy, but it's not going to be too difficult. So the best thing you can do right now is try to go around the planet, all around the, all around the world before uh, heading to the floating continent and then get yourself ready because we're also missing one uh, party member and that's Mog. Not to mention we're also going to be spending some time just trying to... Um, get ourselves leveled up, grinded, to start grinding a little bit and getting ourselves ready though because there's a plethora of challenges headed our way. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take a small sabbatical and we're going to return to the floating continent when we're ready. So, I will see you when everything is all nice and prepared. Much love. Peace.